So another technique I'd like to show you is how to do some hand expression, and that can come in handy when you're trying to um, express some colostrum or some milk for the baby. Um, early on, when you're in the first few days and making colostrum, uh, usually you're able to express just very small amounts. Um, and colostrum fl flow is usually very slow. You're just going to compress kind of behind the nipple, which is where the baby would also compress if they were feeding. You can kind of see yeah, a There's very a drop slow, starting. Yep. For. Mm -hmm. And at, at early on, that may be all that you get is a few drops. And it can be very slow. So you have to be patient. And then we can get a few drops like this, and we can suck that into a syringe and feed the baby. So is it like... You can use both hands if you're more comfortable. And if you have someone to hold the spoon for you. Oh, that's right. Let's mm -hmm. see. But a partner can do that. There, that's... So why, so I don't want to touch the nipple, or I do want to touch Usually the nipple? if you compress the nipple, it just blocks off the ducts and you don't get okay. very good at being. Will this ever, will I ever get more flow than this? Yes. Because so this, this is going to take a long time. Yes. So after your milk transitions and you are producing larger volumes of milk, then usually you get a faster flow with hand expression. 